Hi class, today we'll discuss quadratic equation in one variable. Let us see what do you mean by quadratic equation. First thing, it's a polynomial equation in the form of ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0 and definitely a not equal to 0. This is your quadratic equation in one variable. And this is your standard form, standard form, or you can say general form for expressing a quadratic equation. Now look carefully, over here you have one variable, isn't it? And the degree of this polynomial is 2. For example, if you take, uh, suppose, 3x square minus 4x minus 4 equals to 0. So this is your polynomial equation of degree 2. So it is known as a quadratic equation. Even if you talk about suppose 3x square minus 4x equals to 0. Over here the constant part is 0. This is also a quadratic equation. Similarly if I say 3x square minus 4 equals to 0. These are all my quadratic equation in one variable. Because in all the cases, you see the degree of x is 2. But if I tell you 3x plus 5 equals to 0. This is not your quadratic equation. This is your linear equation. Now look carefully. The degree of x is 2. Which means we will have we will have two solutions. What do you mean by this? Which means there will be two values of x. There will be, there will be, there will be two values of x which satisfies the equation, which satisfies the equation. What do I mean by this? Look carefully. Suppose I take an example x square minus 7x plus 12 equals to 0. Now this is a quadratic equation in one variable. Now put the value of x as 3 suppose. So x as 3. So what will we have? 3 square minus 7 into 3 plus 12 which is equal to 9 minus 21 plus 12 which is equal to 0. So x equals to 3. x equals to 3 is the solution which is also known as the root of the equation. Now I told you we'll have two solutions, we'll have two roots. Now look for if you put x as 4, then what you are getting? 4 square minus 7 multiplied by 4 plus 12, which is 16 minus 28 plus 12, which is equal to 28 minus 28, which is 0. Hence, x equals to 4 is also the root. So there will be two roots of a quadratic equation. Both satisfies the equation. Now look at exercise 5.1 from MN Agarwal, which is based on these properties of quadratic equation. Now look at exercise 5.1 from MN Agarwal. The first sum says, determine whether the given numbers are the root of the equation or not. Just substitute the root over here. If it is equal to 0, then they are the root. Look over here. First case, I'll put instead of x as 2. So 2 square minus 5 into 2 plus 6, which is equal to 4 <coughs> minus 10 plus 6, which is equal to 0. Let us see the second case, minus 3. So we'll put minus 3 square minus 5 into minus 3 plus 6, which is equal to 9 plus 15 plus 6, which is not equal to 0, which means we can say 2 is the root, minus 3 is not the root of the equation. Am I clear? Now look at 3 part 2. If 2 by 3 is the solution of the equation, this, find k. Very simple. Since this is the solution, of this quadratic equation, we can instead of x put 2 by 3 because that is the root of the equation. Okay, 
So I'll write 7 2 by 3 whole square plus k multiplied by 2 by 3 minus 3 equals to 0. Now we'll solve this. This is 7 multiplied by this is 4 by 9 plus 2k by 3 minus 3 equals to 0 which is equal to 28 by 9 plus 2k by 3 minus 3 equals to 0 which is equal to if I take LCM that's 9 so 28 plus 6k minus 27 equals to 0 which means 6k plus 1 equals to 0 9 multiplied by 0 gives you 0 only so 6k equals to 1 minus 1 sorry so k equals to minus 1 by 6 so your k is what minus 1 by 6 and that's the answer clear now look at 4 part 1 same time if root 2 is a root of the equation k x square plus root 2x minus 4 equals to 0 find k similarly same way instead of x we will substitute root 2 because root 2 is one of the root or the solution so what I will get k root 2 square plus root 2 multiplied by root 2 minus 4 equals to 0 which is how much this is k root 2 square <coughs> will be 2 plus root 2 multiplied by root 2 is 2 minus 4 equals to 0 which means 2k minus 2 equals to 0 which means 2k equals to 2 which means k equals to 1 and that's my solution k equals to 1 now let us look at the next sum now look at sum number 4 part 2 if a is the root of the equation x square minus a plus b bracket x plus k equals to 0 find the value of k same manner instead of x we will put a because a is the root of the solution so what will we get c a square minus a plus b a plus k equals to 0 this is a square minus this is a square minus a b when you open the bracket plus k equals to 0 this cancels out which means minus a b plus k equals to 0 which means k equals to a b and that's my solution am I clear now look at sum number 5 which says if 2 by 3 and minus 3 are the roots of the equation px square plus 7x plus q equals to 0 find p and q very simple there will be two cases in the first case see your x is 2 by 3 this is the root so instead of x we will put over here so p 2 by 3 whole square plus 7 2 by 3 plus q equals to 0 so what we are getting this is 4p by 9 plus 14 by 3 plus q equals to 0 take 9 LCM so this becomes 4p plus this becomes 42 plus 9q equals to 0 which becomes 4p plus 42 plus 9q equals to 0 so 4p plus 9q equals to minus 42 that's my first equation am I clear now in the second case your x is minus 3 this is one of the root so instead of x we'll put minus 3 so p minus 3 whole square plus 7 minus 3 plus q equals to 0 which means 9p minus 21 plus q equals to 0 which means 9p plus q equals to 21 this is your second equation now very simple look over here what I'll do I'll try to eliminate q so I'll multiply this equation by 1 and this equation by 9 we have done this in class 9 simultaneous linear equation I'm solving it by elimination method so when you multiply this by 1 you get 4p plus 9q equals to minus 42 and when you multiply this by 9 you get 81p plus 9q equals to and was a 9 189 now look carefully the coefficient of q becomes same so on subtraction we need to change the sign okay q cancels out so what remains minus 77p is equal to minus this is 231 
ओके सो पी विल बी इक्वल टू माइनस टू थर्टी वन बाई माइनस सेवन सेवन विच इज थ्री टाइम्स इट गोज सो ये पी इज थ्री वन सू गेट पी पुट द वैल्यू ऑफ पी इन एनी ऑफ द इक्वेशन सपोज आई पुट ओवर इ पुटिंग द वैल्यू ऑफ पी इन इक्वेशन टू वट यू आर गेटिंग सी नाइन पी विच इज ट्वेंटी सेवन प्लस क्यू एज इट इज इक्व ट्वेंटी वन सो योर क्यू विल बी ट्वेंटी वन माइनस ट्वेंटी सेवन विच इज इक्वल टू माइनस सिक्स एम आई क्लियर सो योर पी इज थ्री एंड योर क्यू इज माइनस सिक्स सो दिस वॉज द लास्ट सम फॉर दिस एक्सरसाइज इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो वी लुक एट द नेक्स्ट एक्सरसाइज एंड सम मोर प्रॉपर्टीज ऑन क्वाडिटिक इक्वेशन इन वन वेरिएबल्स